You're listening to MIP Talk Minutes. This is an excerpt from the Innovation and Humanities Summit 2010 Special Edition. I'm on this book tour, and a lot of what has really grabbed the media is this perspective of the immigrant advantage. And I talk about just why do immigrants come to this country, and they seemingly do so well. Right. And it's why because, is that? Well, I've nailed it down or boiled it down to six core things. One is that an immigrant comes in this country having already experienced corruption, and they've already experienced economic or political unrest, and so they understand what that is like, but yet they continue to fight the resiliency to make good of what they have mm-hmm. and the resources that they have. So they come into this country, they see the foundation that we have here, and they see that we're the land of opportunity, so they just work their tail off to see and seize opportunity. That's one. So so what we consider graft, corruption, and those kinds of things are just, uh, you know, it's Little League, too. It's just, Little League. Some people to... are coming and they're like, really? You're that's complaining right. about that? Yeah, we complain and they take advantage of it. Yeah. Okay, that's one, because yeah. they see things differently. So we see it as an obstacle, and they're it, like, it's just, okay, it's just something to get around. Well, and that leads to the second point is that I grew up in my 20s thinking that in America, you had a choice to be an entrepreneur, while in Latin America or different immigrant countries in the world, you actually have to be an op- entrepreneur just to survive. And so yeah. that's that's something that most people here in this country don't see. And so because we immigrants see that everything is an opportunity, we approach life with a very uh, this desire to have this entrepreneurial spirit because opportunities come our way. The third thing is that we're very passionate, and most immigrants come to this country and they don't have to have a passionate personality, but they have deep desires to achieve. And they come in this country and it all all they see is opportunity. What are they going to do? So you're not Either. talking passion in the sense of the uh, the Italian cook who's running around. You're talking about you know really that that drive to succeed or that drive to to see your goals. Through. Well, both. I mean, look. Asians. It can be that. It as can well. be both. Right. It can right. be. You could be a stoic, you know, but, but and be passionate. But you can be stoic and be very desirous. And mm-hmm. so you have a lot of people that come in this country who are just burning to make good of their lives and, the, the, truth. and, and yeah. the opportunity. And the other thing is, and this kind of is an extension of immigrant perspective, is that immigrants see things that others don't see. Because we've lived through the corruption and the fights and all the resiliency, we could actually anticipate change and reform. So we can course correct quite quickly and be very proactive on that next mm. step. So all those immigrants are in this country now experiencing what we're going through right now with this recession. They don't look at it as a recession. They look at it as opportunity. <laughs> To download this complete interview, please visit miptalk.com. That's M-I-P-T-A-L-K dot com.